Girls love scenarios. G girls love? You know, Yuri, GL. If I can't come up with a good passionate scene, I feel like Replica Game's never going to end. Replica Game? Ko, you okay? It really is you, isn't it? You're Lily Maiden, aren't you? Oh, why, yes, I am. You know my work? I do. It's one of my weekly pleasures. But the story's pace has been kind of... Mm, unbearable lately. Oh, you need to get out of this rut and move on with the narrative. I'm sick of waiting to find out who the replica is. Oh... And the Eighth Maiden, for that matter. She's always just shown in silhouette, and I've had enough of it. <sighs> Ko, can't you see you're breaking her already fragile dreams? I'm just trying to motivate her. It's do or die right now. If the next issue is good, the series could really take off. Whoa, Ko being supportive? Who knew? Oh, but this time's different. I am at my limit here. So you're just going to give up and run away? I have been looking forward to new issues of your manga every week, you know. I'm afraid I'm going to have to forbid you from quitting. You got that? Answer me. Yeah, yes ma'am. You've really been keeping up with her manga every single week, Ko? It's good. And the character designs are really cute. Then don't you think maybe there's something more we can do to help her? Such as? Um, well... Oh, uh, perhaps you might be able to pick up some supplies for me. Oh, uh, if, if that's all right, anyway. I actually came to Akihabara for that exact purpose, but in the end, I think it was really just an escape. Sounds good. What do you say, Ko? Let's get her some supplies. Wow, you'd really go to all that trouble for me? Oh, yeah, no problem. You just keep focused on coming up with new material, and we'll handle the rest. Thank you so very much. Somehow or another, I am going to make this happen. I swear I will. I am going to go to the Max Celsius Cafe in front of the station and try to get some work done. You can find me there. Why do I have to be bothered getting art supplies? You look forward to a new issue of her manga every week, don't you? Well, yes, but... So then what's the problem? We give her a helping hand, though... Crap, we never asked her what supplies she needed. I know what she needs. We'll just go to Animart on Main Street. They have a nice selection there. Uh, Co? for such places personally. It's a safe point. Shall we make use of it before moving on? Go buy what she needs. Have fun. Got it. Well, that was quick. What did you end up buying? Writing paper and screen tone sheets. Oh, 
You sure that was wise? There are a lot of different kinds of screen tone, you know. I definitely chose the right ones. Trust me, I know. Man, you really are a fan of her work. I bought her a G-Pen, too. Oh, one of those pens designed specifically for writing manga? Aren't there a bunch of different kinds of those, too? She's talked about it on Quipper before, and I recognize this particular brand from one of my favorite photos of her. You were able to recognize the pen from a photo? That's incredible. To me, all pens pretty much look the same. Even a tenth of a millimeter difference in the thickness of the tip gives each pen a totally different character. They're tools of the trade. You should know better than to underestimate them. Ugh, that's why you're a neat. I really don't think there's any correlation there at all, actually. Ugh, whatever. Believe what you want. We've gathered up everything we need, so we're done here. Okay, let's go deliver it to her then. If I recall, she said she'd be at Maxelsier Cafe in the Station Plaza. Shall we purchase trading cards? Remember, we all make our own luck. Delusionscape? Please be well prepared. Ah, there she is. I bought you a bunch of things. It should be everything you need. Oh, these are perfect. I use a G-Pan in this kind of tone all the time. You knew just what to get me. Thank you both so much. Oh, he doesn't need any thanks. He's just in need, so he's got nothing better to do with his time anyway. Wow, that hurts, you know. So, did you think of a good way to progress the story? I sure did. The perfect continuation, in fact. Just now, thanks to you two. Oh, well, glad we could help, I guess. But all I did was buy you things. No, no, trust me. It's the two of you just being who you are that helped inspire me. Though, if it's all right with you, I'd love to chat you up a bit more for research to help liven up the narrative. For research? Ah, I, I see, I see. Um, so Katomi here is a big fan of dolls, then. And Asahi's a college dropout turned neat. What could you possibly be getting out of listening to us talk about our lives? Yeah, what kind of story are you planning exactly? Um, well, the true identity of the Eighth Maiden is going to be a razor-tongued gothic Lolita girl. And her master will be a strapping yet aimless young neat boy. But in reality, their roles are reversed. The neat who thought was in charge is in fact the girl's slave. That's a bit odd. I can kind of see it. I'll look forward to reading it. It's pretty good, right? I'm seriously so indebted to you two. Well, get to work. I expect to find the next issue on the shelf at the regular time, and it won't write itself. Don't you worry. I will make it. Oh, thanks again. Seriously? A razor-tongued gothic Lolita girl and a neat manservant? Something wrong with that? Oh, uh, nothing. Nothing at all. No, I think I understand, actually. You do? Yes, I get it. You're worried that with the time loop and all, the new issue will never actually get finished. You think that's what my problem is here?
saving. Do be careful not to override a sibling's data. Event is about to 